with the Acolyte and Disney Star Wars becoming so indefensibly bad, the shills and shill media have completely lost all control over the narrative, and they cannot get it back. And now they are resorting to completely insane strategies, thus trying to attack Star Wars theory of all people, and claiming that because of his actions, they are now receiving threats. Of all the people they could have tried this on, they literally chose the absolutely worst guy ever. That's amazing. These are the kind of videos I just really don't live for. I just don't like doing these kinds of videos. I think they're so ridiculous. But here we are. You guys remember during the live stream? I'm not going to drag it out. The live stream. Not his first throw there, oh man. He has been attacked by so many idiots over the years. It's kind of impressively insane. For the watch party. And you guys were spamming chat like crazy, like, check Wikipedia, they just changed it. And uh, I did, and I reacted to it. I'm like, holy crap, they're actually changing it in real time with, like, no reason whatsoever just because the show says so and, like, changes everything like that. What was... To be fair, this has already happened in multiple different franchises, and I think this is not even the first time this happened to Star Wars. Something comes out and the Wikipedia literally gets instantaneously updated with it. Which is kind of insane, technically. It's pre-established for what they, they had. They had what they had written for however many years, and then they just, boom, like that, change it. On a show that really makes no sense and has no business putting Kiadi in there. So now, I guess because... He, he's kind of talking about Kiadi Mundi here, but... I mean, <laughs> the show just doesn't make any sense at all. They, they At this point, they need, they, they need to redefine what fire is in this universe because man it's it's not the fire i know it's not the fire anyone knows it burns bricks it roars in space they, it, it's quite insanity because i'm making good arguments they have a few psychos a few assholes that are going around sending them death threats and now their audience and they themselves are purporting that i am the one sending these threats it is so first of all he did literally nothing <laughs> He did nothing of the sort. That's the best part. He does absolutely nothing. And they're like, ah, him. It's him. And the second part is, I don't believe a single, a, a, a single word of this. I do not believe they received a single threat, by the way. I, I just don't believe it, okay? Literally do not believe it. Every time they say, oh, look at these crazies. They're sitting there, blah, 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 blah. They're, they're lying. They they never show a single uh, a single email a single message a single anything, because they have learned over the years. Whenever they do, they just get laughed even harder at because those are not even remotely close to threats or anything like that. It's just someone saying, "Wow, you must have had a real rough childhood, considering you did something this stupid." <laughs> Man, it's so crazy and dumb. Me, my responsibility, my fan base, my people. And I made a statement statement on X on Twitter that is erroneous, that is ridiculous. How many times do I have to make videos where I denounce this kind of behavior? I mean, if we're going to start measuring death threats, I think... It's time that Terry used his platform, his reach, and his influence to denounce the threats and, uh, and, and the attacks with the largest voice in Star Wars community simply, ca simply casually... Con uh, uh, covering his own ass with remember be respectful doesn't cut it then what does cut it okay let's completely ignore the fact that this this the, this whole tweet is absolutely stupid then what does cut it should should he just go and police every single person who has ever watched his videos or what, what, what do you want from him what do you want from a person than saying uh more than don't do anything stupid I honestly don't even do that little because it's not my responsibility that there exist psychos if they even exist, which I honestly completely doubt at this point. Politely F yourself. These aren't my people. Don't attach that to me or they, there will be serious consequence for you. Well said. The, uh, these are people on their own. Nothing to do with me. Please find where... Well, the tweet cuts off there, but you get the point. I mean, uh, might as well blame anyone who you dislike uh, on uh, on some other person you dislike and say it's their responsibility to stop it. It's just stupid. It makes no sense. I think I take the frickin' prize for that one. I think I take 
the amount oh yeah it's telling that we didn't get any threats until immediately after he i like that they use he because they probably don't want to at him oh jesus gross fine told his followers to fix wikipedia uh the ones that came to vandalize the site from uh from that are the ones we get threats from how do you even know that like do, do, do they sign off as Star Wars Theory's greatest fan or something like that? <laughs> Man, every time a conversation like this happens, you know it's just the dumbest shit ever. Because, again, we're still in the victim game here. They do not get it wrong, the victim game is always here. And the only way that some people can be right about something is by convincing others that they are somehow magically a victim of something. Be it imaginary, be it non-existent, as long as they are a victim, that's good enough for them because that means they're right. And they don't need to take any responsibility, don't need, they don't need to prove anything, and you can't say, any, uh, say anything bad against them because you're the victim. The victim game never stops. Out of abuse that these people send me is insane but that's the price you get when you are on youtube it's not that is way more believable by the way than th them saying that they get, uh, got hate Th there's absolutely no way not favorable i wish it wouldn't happen i could go into stories and story we can we can have a channel about uh abuse that happens online and i'm not the only one it's everybody online so look I have denounced this kind of behavior so many times. I don't know about that. The only uh, emails I get are, uh, my wife really enjoys, uh, enjoys your com uh, commentary, and everyone's just fa making fun that I don't have a wife. Unfair. Unfair. Times. But to go ahead and say that because there are a few psychos who disagree with a decision that you made, Wikipedia, and then to throw that, your decision to do something with your business, your channel, your website and the angry fans that came from that decision and to say that a few of those psychos and bad apples are because of me is really really wrong i have always told people and super stupid obviously obviously it's wrong first i guess because you know that's just a com well we already know what that fully is it's just it's just it's just wrong and again it's super stupid you're talking about a guy who has enough income to actually sue you. Now, Obi, I don't actually know is Wikipedia part of Wikipedia because, you know, the theory needs to watch out for, you know, uh, one magical day just choosing to unalive himself with a cord 50 miles away from his house uh, on a tree branch and, you know, using a shotgun to his chest because, you know, that's legit. But, you know, maybe Wikipedia doesn't have anything to do with the Wikipedia, so he doesn't have to worry about the FBI and CIA and other random three-letter organizations. People to be extremely polite and extremely respectful, and I've never told anyone to send death threats to anybody because I'm, I get it the most. I really do. Yeah. It's so funny that he actually needs to say, yeah, surprise, surprise, I haven't done that. Wow, unexpected, right? It's crazy. I have the largest Star Wars channel in the world and with that comes the most passionate fandom with that comes a lot of anger entitlement jealousy perhaps whatever and with so he should have actually got in there a peter parker granddad i mean a lot of power comes with a lot of responsibility peter so you better not fuck up with that <laughs> comes a lot of you filter it down just crazy people i've gotten every single death threat in the book uh, i've had people call my parents i've had it People send our threats to women I've dated. The list goes on. And not to make it about me, but I am trying to tell you that I know firsthand how... I remember the first time I got them, it was I was like, what? This exists? But now it's just like, oh yeah, cool. Get in line. <laughs> uh, I remember uh, reading a Forbes article about Wikipedia. They do, if I'm not mistaken, it's... He's actually not even thinking that they're lying. The, my first reaction to this would be, be instantaneously, yeah, you're lying. None of this happened. No one who cares to change the Wikipedia back to normal actually cares enough to send you anything.
It's online somewhere. You can find it. Back in 2015 or whatever it was, they do 120 million. It's online. 120 million page visits a month, which is insane as websites pay like 10x YouTube. 120 million. And that was 2015. I mean, maybe I'm getting the numbers wrong, but it it was something ridiculous. Enough for Forbes to make an article about it. Wait, 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 wait. Was he talking about the bookie, Wikipedia? 20 million. It's on. Or whatever it was. They do. If I'm not mistaken, it's online somewhere. You can. Wait, let's check. I didn't hear. Uh, I remember uh, reading a Forbes article about Wikipedia. They do. Oh, Wikipedia. Jesus Christ. That many views. That's insane. About it. An entire article for them. So. Of those 120 million people, you're going to tell me that the people that are pissed are all from my fan base? Duh! Obviously. Oh, just as long as they can point a finger at someone. I wonder if it wasn't him who then they would blame at random. I really do. No, dude. You... Because we all see the pride flag, so you know that they're going to blame someone. <laughs> they're going to always blame someone. You got like. What is that? 50 times, literally 50 times my subs- my entire subscriber base you get in views per month. Please do not make these claims. I run at this point a very serious company who handles a lot of different jobs and tasks. And I do not appreciate the slander that you are throwing towards my... He's effectively saying, hey, I actually run a company. And when you run a company big enough, which he... I don't actually know how big it is or whatever, but he does run quite a lot of shit and whatnot. There's a chance that there's a legal department, and guess what? When you have a legal department, you don't actually need to pay them for suing people because that's their job. So, you know, if he wants, he can just look into this, by the way, for completely free and see if there's anything that uh, that could come out of this. Now, my guess is he probably doesn't want a headache, because it doesn't matter who you sue, when you sue, what you sue. If both both parties have money, I, I doubt that Terry wants to go into, like, a five-year-long circus battle. My company. If you continue to lie and purport that my company is sending you death threats or hoarding my followers to send you death threats, we'll take legal action against you. Do not like that defamation. You are quite a big presence. You're not a little shrimp fry on Twitter with a couple followers. If you continue, I will file a lawsuit against you. Telling you right now. That being said, no, I do not condone death threats. I've never sent fans against anybody to send death threats. People have free will. Just like they're sent towards me. They can be sent towards anybody. You know what's the saddest part about it? He he was forced to say this, so I didn't do it and blah blah blah. Because if you don't say this, people are going to be uh, all idiot idiots and be like, yeah, well, he didn't know the fact that he did it, which makes him responsible. Or something stupid like that. It's just a circus logic thing. People are assholes. There's asshole people everywhere. I can't control that. All I can do is say, be respectful. Statistically, by the way, the, uh, the higher the likelihood is that Wikipedia's own fans did that because they changed something. <laughs> that is, by the way, statistically more likely than uh, the other way around. What, what do you think that means? Be respectful, but hey, send death threats. I'd appreciate it if you and anyone else trying to defame the company would stop. You persist. We can take it from there. You know, you did something that people didn't like. I know firsthand when you do stuff like that, uh, people will have a reaction. It's on the internet. So that's it. That's all I got to say about it. I didn't want to make a statement, throw out to upload a video about it, but, uh, you know, it's... Well, you have to sadly make a statement about this. And guess what's now going to happen? People are going to look at this and be like, wow, these assholes actually tried to throw him of all people under the bus? <laughs> they, they really tried that. Losers. Well, never again will I ever do anything with Wikipedia. Never I have done anyway, actually. You know, I'm that average Star Wars fan. You know, it's cool, but, you know, my heart's not in the game as much as other people. So, yeah, this is going to have uh, this is going to have an effect, obviously, and it's not going to be good for them. But as the, at the end of the day, guess what? You reap what you sow. And they sue. <laughs> Not the best of things, okay?
it's it's now to the point where you're slandering my company and I want to this is the first step I take these things very seriously especially with a uh, a brand of your size so hey all the best guys don't send anybody death threats if you want to argue something do so respectfully as I've said millions of times and that is also documented as well for the public and potentially the courts so Yay. have a great day may the force be with you love you all. nice very cool anyway i wonder how this is gonna go now that this is happening because probably a lot of people are going to talk about this obviously it involves the acolyte it involves star wars in general it involves a Wikipedia with the rainbow flag right here, which doesn't speak volumes about their dedication to actually being a real company, not an activist group. And, well, I mean, I would wish Star Wars Theory the best of luck, but he doesn't need that even. He he, he got it. There's nothing, nothing bad is going to happen from this. And he rightfully put these losers in their place. 10 out of 10. Hey, who said good things don't come out of the Acolyte? You know, he pro he didn't want to do this, but hey, he, he did everyone a favor. Anyway, bye.